Because what our brains are really wired to do is to, that we're assumption machines. You know, that's how we get to be high functioning. We don't have to think about everything. You see a few bits of data and then you fill in the rest. I know what that person's like, what that, the, what, how it's going to go. I know that if we try that, it's never going to work. And so what we really want to do is suspend that. And I don't know, just play around. It doesn't have to work. We just want to play around. And then time out is really also very, very critical. It is that thing of just laying back. Because we do experience that that is where things arise to consciousness. And we call that an aha moment. So you want to facilitate ahas. You want to provide for those connections to come together. And you go, wow, I never had that thought before. New information, stimulated connections of what is already there as well as new experiences. So you're building those data stores. Marching forward, you want to build into your processes that the way you do your work, the way you problem solve is by going left. What is it that we're trying to achieve? What's the best question? What is it that we really need to know that we don't yet know? Let's design a process so that we can go figure that out and do what I call pour and stir. Pour in new information, new experiences, and then do the play. Start to build those cross bridges so that you can have many more associations and insights. And then you come back into the left brain. You go, OK, so what form is there? What choices do we want to make? And that, that really needs to be integrated into how you do any kind of exploration, strategy, innovation, meeting, because it really does yield something much different than trying to get there through language alone. 